Before we dive into today's shenanigans, this episode is brought to you by Dad Water. Nice. Dab Water is a non-carbonated, zero-sugar tequila water with natural flavors. The four flavors are Gary, also known as Pineapple Jalapeno, Steve, good old grapefruit, Rodney, a.k.a. Blood Orange, and my personal favorite, Tom, a.k.a. Lama Ruski. Tom's a simple man of all means, loves taking care of his lawn on a Sunday morning. Shoot, he's looking to get a tiny bit athletic when called upon, <laughs> if you know what I mean. What? Hoopstar, what about you? You know, my guy is Rodney, I think. He's just grilling up some dogs in the backyard with the pool. His kids driving them crazy. All he wants to do, take the car out for a spin with the windows down and just say his hellos. Hey, nothing wrong with getting a little glizzied out. Love it, love it. All four dads bring a unique flavor to Dad Water's fruit-infused tequila water. Whether you're already a dad-tastic father figure in someone's life, an aspiring baby daddy like Hoopstar and myself, or just looking to get a little bit athletic with the boys on the weekend, choose your favorite and join us for a drink, a couple of laughs, and hell, a damn good time. And hey, we might not be dads just yet, but uh... <coughs> After a couple of dad waters, shoot, we gonna be on our way there, soldier. Dab water variety packs can be ordered online or can be purchased at a retailer near you. Just visit their website at www.drinkdadwater.com or click the link in the episode description to grab your favorite flavors today. Cheers. All right, just got tied it up on the thigh. I think we just might be all right, thank God. Shout out to, uh, Pride and glory tattoo. I think we just might be alright. What's your what's your pain level right now? Probably a four. Four? Yeah, that feels good. Because are you done? <laughs> <laughs> she done yet? Or what about what about thigh? Are we feeling? <laughs> Alright, it's uh thinking about going to get my third tattoo. What do you think, Liam? I think it's good. Yeah. We, uh... Like it? It, he came back from the walk and said, hey, we're about to go get a tattoo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, all right, let's go. All right, so I got this one, which is really corny. I got it when I was 18 in Knoxville. It's like the skyline. It's very corny. And then I got this one. There's a couple pubes on it, but it's lips, Google images. And yeah, I think I'm going to get a, a quote next. What about on thigh? Okay. Or, I'm sorry, on uh, bicep. Nah. You want to be able to read it, don't you? Yeah, I don't think my bicep's big enough. Maybe on my chest. either on my thigh or on my chest. And uh, I guess here's the before. I guess you can't really see anything, but we'll show the after. Walk-in's available. Let's go get this thing done. We are at uh, Pride and Glory in downtown Nashville. About to get tatted. I didn't know if I wanted it on the chest. I'm gonna quote either on the chest or the thigh. Ask them, said the thigh is the move. So stay tuned. Uh, but check this place out, it's actually super cool. Check it out if you want. on my pelvis and that was probably the last time yeah that was the last one that I got and oh I heard you say you had the skyline 
You got the skyline, then I got lips on my pelvis. Spring break tattoo. Nice. And then I said, all right, that's probably the last time I'm doing this. Cool. I think we just might be alright. What's your what's your pain level right now? I have four. Four? Yeah, that feels good. Because are you done? <laughs> <laughs> Is he done yet? Oh man. That's pretty cool actually. Alright. Uh feeling good, feeling good. Just got the tat tattoo. Third tattoo of all time. We're gonna go hit neighbors here in the Gulch, hang out for a little bit before dinner. Any questions? You happy with the tattoo? I like the tattoo. I like the I like the font. It's my favorite font. Shout out Century Gothic. A lot of people don't like that font, but I like it all lowercase except the G and God. So uh, now I got that. I got uh, I got the Lord on my my skin, and now I got to get right with them. So that's kind of the uh, motivation as well.